Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. So today's video is going to be a what's inside my handbag. And this is my um, Gucci. This is the Double G Twins logo tote, I think. But anyway, so right now I'm going to go inside this handbag and I'm going to show you what's inside. But before I do that, guys, let me just show you the tote. The tote, it, double handle has the GG's on both sides, double GG's, one in gold tone, one in silver tone. And it, so now I'm going to take out the biggest items first, the items that I just see, that are just here. Now I'm going to start with my, my glasses, my, my sunglasses. These are Chanel. I don't usually carry this in my bag, but I had it today because I went out to have breakfast with my bestie, my good friend Jackie, it was it's her birthday. And so this, I have my glasses on, I stick the case inside my, my pocketbook. But um, most of the time I'm wearing them on top of my head. But anyway, it was in the bag today, so this is the case. Here are my shades. And I've had these for a couple of years. These are my favorite because they block out a lot of the sun. Nice wide arms right here. I love the fact that it's wide right here. These are my shades. And I have a black pair. But uh, I don't wear those as often as I wear the brown ones because the brown ones are, um, they look nice against my skin tone. Okay, put that there. The next full size item I see or big item that I see in here is my wallet. And my wallet is by Badgley Mishka. And as you can see, it has the um, little, I don't know, the little hardware. Looks like little squares. This is the zipper pull. And let me just, let me show you the back. There's a little pocket in the back that I keep uh, my business cards in. And let me just very quickly, without going through everything, just show you what the inside looks like. Here's a slot here. has money in it. Here I keep some important cards. There's a zipper here that I keep change. Uh, right here are some more card slots. I don't have anything in it. I tend just to throw my cards on this side. Um... Inside here, there is some money, and I think I had some money on the other side, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, had some bills in there, and this is what it looks like in the back here. I usually keep my business cards, and let me just take one out for you all. These are my business cards. So I try to take business cards everywhere I go because last year I had went to two fashion events. One was with Lane Bryant and um, I had business cards, I had my old business cards but I've up updated, uh, updated them to these and um, I just tend to leave business cards everywhere I go so I just I just tend to leave business cards wherever I go especially if I'm going to uh, special events. Alrighty, inside here is my phone and let me just open it up very quickly. This is the iPhone 6 plus. I don't keep a lot of stuff here. I got some cards on the side and this red card is my Sephora VIB Rouge card. That's what's in here and maybe one day I will do a what's inside my iPhone. I don't know if you can see a picture of me and hubby. I don't know if you can see him. He's so cute and these are some of my apps. I have quite a few and yeah and that's my iPhone and also on the side near my iPhone I definitely do keep my um, charging cable here's my charging cable and here's the uh, wall adapter have that put that right there uh, the next thing I have is let me just go right here on the side I'm pulling out all this stuff that's related this right here is my um, this is called a shutter release for my iPhone. This is for that. And I got this from Amazon.com. It came with a selfie stick. And it's all Bluetooth. So it's Bluetooth directly to my um, phone. So for example, when I put up those wonderful pictures on Instagram um, and Facebook and Twitter, what I normally do is I'll turn this on. See the blue light flashing. What I'll do is I'll have my camera on, of course, in um, uh, the camera's on. And what I'll do is I'll usually position the camera the way I want it and then press the larger button at the top. 
and then take a picture and that's how I do it with this so I actually have my hand stretched out and my other hand kind of recessed in the back and I take great pictures with this this is really like a big help I really like this a lot and I don't use the selfie stick that often also inside I just tossed these in my bag and they're full of fingerprints but my peepers in case I need to read small prints these are my glasses that I wear and um, these are just the glasses that you get from like your, the drugstore guys because my vision isn't isn't that bad. Usually during the evening time, it gets difficult for me to read small print, and so this um, this strength is a one a one point zero, like a one. So that's like barely hurt anything, but they help a lot for me, especially when my eyes get tired. And I was recommended to get the one point by my. Um, optometrist so I got it all right so moving in wet ones guys I use these I depend on these every day just to clean up and I usually like to clean up um, my hands frequently during the day so right now I'm gonna just take take this out guys because this is really where all my um, stuff is this is a purse organizer and I picked that up from Amazon.com. But before I show you what's inside the purse organizer, let me just make sure I got everything out. My keys, my car, and and a few other doors. And I love these guys. I usually have one of these every few days. This is a biscotti. It's by DiBella. DiBella, yes. Double chocolate fudge biscotti. I love this. And I usually have this about... 11 o'clock in the morning with, um, with some coffee. So I'm going to have one in my bag. I'll probably eat it, maybe not tomorrow. I'll probably eat it on um, Tuesday or Wednesday. Some pins, safety pins. Safety pins. And let me see. And I think the bag is empty. Yes, it is. Yeah, just some gum papers in there, guys. <laughs> I'm going to take that out. And the bag is empty. It's empty, and this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like empty. See how soft and pretty the leather is. And then you can see the feet on the bottom. It's five feet under the bottom. Five little feet, I should say. And yeah. So now I'm going to go into the purse organizer. Because this is a lifesaver for me. Because if I didn't have the purse say, um, the purse saver. If I didn't have the purse organizer, everything would just be sort of floating around in the center of that bag and so this really does help a lot so very quickly this is a lot of stuff in here I'm gonna go through it this is a spray bottle of alcohol I fill this up like every month and I usually clean off maybe like my um, the computer that I use and the mouse I usually clean it off before I um, I'm not a germaphobe guys I just like to reduce my uh, risk of, of transferring any bacteria from myself to anybody else and vice versa that's really why I use it here is a bottle of lotion and this I got the small bottle was an original bottle of lotion from Lubriderm you got this as a free bottle attached to the larger one so yeah lotion here okay here we have a small package of makeup brushes I just threw this in here five makeup brushes I picked these up from my beauty supply store the five double-ended brushes, and I, this is really nice. I've used them, as you can see, it has makeup trapped inside. I've used them. I like to use them when I have, need to touch up my makeup. If I'm um, outside, I'll look in my mirror. Speaking of my mirror, I'll check out my makeup. And if I want to touch up something, I'll just go right in with those brushes and kind of blend something out. Because I usually don't add any more makeup to my face after I've left. But so during the day, I may want to just blend something out or smooth out my complexion. Um, next thing I have, which I depend on a lot, is my this is my Mac blot powder. I've had this for a while. I can't even see the name anymore. And this is the blot powder in dark. It's in dark. I know the lights are making it look lighter than what it is, but it's really I don't know if you can see. That's the color. That's more like the true color right there. So, moving on, I have some Carmex. This is a lip balm. I have that inside. I love that. It keeps my lips moisturized. Um, inside here, I have a pack of gum. 
Oh, I'm sure I'll tell you about that in a minute. Pack of gum, keep my breath fresh throughout the day, and I keep other people's breath fresh throughout the day because people often throughout the day ask me, "Do you have any gum, Des?" I do. I have. I won't. I won't say no. Um, okay, moving on. I have three pens inside. Put those back. And inside this little pocket right here, I have. I have, let me, I dropped it, okay. I have my my lip pencil. I always use this. This is Roasted Coffee by Kiss. I'll swatch it. Let me swatch it for you. This is my lip liner. That's it. I have a lipstick that I've been loving lately. That's called Myth. That's by MAC. This is it. And that's it right there. Let me pull back a little bit. I have it on right now and this is my uh, lipstick that I well it's like a lip gloss it's like a tingly lip gloss it's meant to plump your lips but it doesn't plump my lips guys this is called marvelous moxie and I can't see the name at the bottom but if I can see it and find it I'll definitely will leave it below and this is by bare minerals this is what it looks like and this is what I have on over top of the myth and let me just put it right here and that's it let me see where is it right here and that's it right there and it just kinda like takes the chalkiness from the myth because myth can be very chalky if you don't apply something else over top of it I do like the myth but I don't like it when it looks too whitish okay also inside here is this is a foundation brush and I basically use this to put on the blot powder and I'll just put it on and just blend it blend it out in this case that I keep it in guys it didn't come in that case this is a case from another um, makeup brush but I just didn't throw out the case I kind of use it to keep this brush in and I just use a piece of tape just to keep it closed so that the brush wouldn't come out and get contaminated in the bag um, I think we're getting down to the wire. I think that's it. I have a couple of other things here. Yes, I do. Okay. Okay, guys. So the next thing is my MAC concealer. I have that in there. This is NW40. This is the color. Oh, let me pull it back because this not the color gets distorted. So, and I have it on today. And I like to carry this because honestly, this is the only concealer that really just blends away my darkness especially the darkness I get right in here just blends it down and it just makes it look really natural and uh, yeah so this is this color is I believe this is the NW40 I think guys I'm not 100% sure yeah NW40 last but not least is my powder foundation this is the little cape package that it comes in the little you know pouch that it comes in this is the urban decay naked skin ultra definition powder foundation in dark warm that's what that says and let me see if I can get that in there so you can see it I don't know if you can see it that's it and this is what it looks like I don't use the mirror guys but this is what the powder <laughs> See, guys, I don't want to get too close because then you get a distorted color of what the powder looks like. Let me see if I can swatch it on my, my hand for you. And I wanted to give you guys a, um, and this is it right here. I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a review on this. I'm not going to do it in this video. Okay, guys, so that is it. That's what's inside here. This was inside my handbag. And so now you have seen inside my handbag. And, uh, okay, thank you so much for joining me. Take care, and I will see you at the next video. Bye-bye.